I have started the recording. The start Last of the recording. We were talking about this. There was a couple times. Where like, Did you start recording? And I was like, yeah, I need. Well, we need to put that light on up there. That would be kind of cool. Live. Yeah. We need like a live well, on, something on like airline. Yeah. Yes. So, so not only other people know, but so I know. Yeah, it's mostly for you. It's, it's, it's very hey, important. It says applause now. Yeah, it's like well, yeah. Oh. My, my last comment was amazing. Yeah. Please, you know, clap. Applause, that. applause. Yeah, people running around with big cue cards. Yeah. Wait, that maybe not. So, you looked up the proper pronunciation for the word that it is on the bottle of beverage that we we're about to have. The beer we we're about well, to we have. Well, we listened. There's a, t- there a weird word. word. Yes, not weird. It's but not it's, weird. It's a, it's a word. It's a word that's whose pronunciation. It's a French word. Is it a French word? Us. Uh, maybe a Belgian word? I don't know what the okay. word is, right. uh, uh, where it originates. But you, we listened to two different ones. One sounded closer to what we thought it was, yeah. and then the other one was kind of kind of different. Yes. But that is going to apply and tie into just, it's going to get wrapped up all in this and that. That's a Seinfeld <laughs> reference. Uh, but anyway. I don't know how it got tied up. Um, yeah. And got Connected. all knotted up and knotted into this. Uh, but anyway, we have a, is this made exclusively for? Correct. Trader Joe's? It is. Okay. So we have a barrel aged, aged something, pale. Okay, I got it. For this Give It a Shot, I'm Andrew. And I'm Keith. And we are about beverages.com. And the beverage that we are about today is being held by Phil Collins. Being held by Phil. Phil Collins. Phil, let us go. It is the uh, <laughs> <laughs> right. it is the Petrus aged pale ale. Uh, it's a it's a sour beer. Um, it is made, as, as uh, Andrew said, exclusively for Trader Joe's in conjunction with, oh my gosh, that's why I had this up here this way. It's in conjunction with Petrus. With Browridge de Brabandere, Oh, I think. That is like... This I probably pronounced that wrong, and I, I did not mean to if I did, but... It was like a combination of like Belgian and like Spanish or something. Yeah. <laughs> and they're all sounds like Antonio Banderas walked in the room, I, and he we, worked yes. on a beer with we did. some <laughs> Belgian beer maker. Yeah, like, yeah. Uh, with with a there. Belgian it's amazing that okay. specializes in sour beers. So, uh, yes, yeah, so it's made ex- exclusively for Trader Joe's. I have to comment, the framing on this is just absolutely fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> this is just so good. His, uh, uh, normally, we kind of introduce Phil like in more of a slower tone, a uh, little more of a like, oh, we've got this special guest. But comedic. unfortunately, we did not have uh, a better picture of this beer right here because it's weird. If it's stuff that's exclusive to different stores, it doesn't even have to be traded. It could be anywhere. Um, a lot of times, it's just people's random quick picks and like other things. Like right. there's never the actual like the because the brewery itself usually doesn't promote it. Right. And then, like I said, especially when it's Trader Joe's, they don't really have they don't they do have a kind lot of a either. website. They don't really have some other presence of right. uh, things. They do have an Instagram, but Instagram, I don't know. They don't put yeah. this kind of stuff up. But anyway, so it just worked out that Phil's longing look is going to be what you get to all see for this <laughs> entire uh, give it a shot. Uh, unfortunately, for a minute, we do have to take the bottle back because we need to open it. Yes. Okay. So why don't you grab that? I'm going to get the glasses out that were hiding just below camera. And uh, okay. All right. I will start working on this. Is there any so, other? Uh, so this. So we've had several of these kind of collaborations. Yeah, last year they the first one that was released was the was the aged pale, um, and it was oh, so. So the word we were talking about before <laughs> is the the, oh. the barrel oh, the yeah, oak sorry, the oak barrel no the oak barrel uh, the the word is spelled f o e d e r and I've at different places I've read that it's pronounced fooder. I've read. I uh, thought uh, it was uh, either footer Fodor? or Fodor. No, but now we're but now we're hearing we think it's like Fodor. Fodor. It's Fodor? like folder without the L. Fodor. Anyone please uh, chime in, let us know, <laughs> correct us. <laughs> what? Yeah. I was say type it in the comments below. Oh wait, I don't know what that's pronounced like that's unless right. you literally phonetically right. do it. <laughs> you you have to option. yeah. Um, got to wait on this one. Got to wait. Yeah. Right. Protect oh, the keyboard. That was like, so yeah, I've got a keyboard. We've got a stream deck. This this table gets more expensive by the week. <laughs> we gotta, yeah, we're going to have to coat it, uh, make sure it's uh, water pr- protected from yeah. beverages. Uh, so last year's here. was uh, n- uh, number 222 that it came from. This is, uh, I think, one, 102. 102. Um, and in the last year, uh, this brewery has done a cherry version, a blueberry version, a grapefruit version, a raspberry version. There may have even been something else in there that I'm forgetting, but so we've had several versions of this beer. Um, th- uh, there's a little sour indicator, the sour scale on this. Yeah, beer. I don't know whose sour um, scale it is, but there is a sour scale, and it uh, it's saying five out of five. Oh, you know, you can give this back to Phil. Oh, I feel bad. Oh. He's looking a little sad over there. He can have that. Wow, perfect. Actually, That's great, fantastic. Okay, so there's that. 
So yeah, wow, that is clear as the day is long. Clear and yeah, nice coppery. Yeah, you can't. Goodness. Sometimes you got to do in front of. See, we got all these green screens and all these weird. Oh, pictures. yeah, we so I'll do, do it like this. I'll do in front of the shirt, and you can kind of tell yes. how more like golden it is. It's a little more, I think, yellow in person. It's. But it's you, golden. You should, you should have a little more water. You're slightly dehydrated if this is the color. Yeah, you don't want things yeah. to. Yeah, to be. Yeah, you definitely. This is an indicator of <laughs> needing more water. Yeah, yes. exactly. You would need yeah. more fluid. So it's that kind of color. <laughs> if that's that's not going to be our new color scale. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> the right amount of water need more water need more water <laughs> yeah what would it be if it's color in the bowl about stout it's oh yeah. dead yeah you were dead <laughs> if, this, if this is see your doctor <laughs> see your doctor immediately Don't consult wait four hours the, consult a physician <laughs> immediately <laughs> yeah. well i as soon as i was pouring this our next thing is always aroma. the aroma see i could smell it right away that smells excellent yeah nice balance uh, a little, can, little funk Little little funk. Funk. I get like almost like a ginger. There's like a there's like a spice going there on. There is a little spice of, of like some that. kind in there. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. But there's a really nice sharp. The return tart. of ginger spice. <laughs> it is the return. <laughs> it's like a nice. Yeah. There's a lemon in there. There's some really nice tart coming through. A little funk. And then yeah, there's like a nice yeah. ginger cinnamon kind of cardamom. Yes, yeah, I was gonna say cinnamon. But yeah. Some... It's not. It's not like you now. Don't think that's going too far. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. not like when you have pie no. or a pumpkin no, spice no. beer or something weird like that. Like it's not that or like a really. Uh, I don't know, classic, almost like American kind of wheat beer where it's like that yeah. really heavy no, clothing. It's, not, it's that. not that. No. But I agree. All those things are in there. Yep. My mouth is already watering. Yeah, me too. Well, let's do it. Mm-hmm. This is this is a little more... Um, we were talking about how last year's we thought was a good introduction to sour beer uh, for people who maybe didn't like you know, or hadn't had one, wasn't their favorite, or maybe wanted to try one. We thought it was a more uh, a beginner's version. Right. I don't think this is quite the beginner version. No. But we've definitely had more that are. But this has got some nice. This is delicious. It's got some nice flavor in there. I really like this. I was not quite expecting what I was going to. I was kind of like, eh, it's probably like because the last year it's like, okay, that was good, but it wasn't like anything exciting. This is quite good. I really like everything we talked about in the aroma. I get it in the flavor, which I love when there's not like some crazy, yeah. like disparate, like, oh, I smelled all that. Now I get nothing. of. There's that. But then there is like the heat. tart. Is, yeah, there's a little heat going down, I think <laughs> yeah. maybe from those spices. Um, there's a little vanilla in there, too. And like I said, the, the fruit that's going on really hits the middle of my tongue. Yep. There's nice, just tart, acidic, sour kind of going on. Yeah, I have things that are even palate. more tart, but this is pretty this is pretty tar- i don't know if yeah. it's a if your scale is a five and you're five out of five this isn't quite a five out of five but no. this is a three and a half to four like this yeah. is pretty good yeah because last year's it's probably like for us would have been like, like a two i was just gonna say two yeah uh two out of five but this has got a lot of res- good residual flavor that just kind of lingers and uh it's very wow. even last year when we were saying we didn't think that one was all that puckery we still said it's a well-made beer Mm -hmm. and like i said good introduction too this this is definitely uh this this fooder or this fodder was uh (laughs) had a little more depth uh gave a little bit so it it always gave a wee bit more than a bind um yeah i think the the flavor in here is 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 excellent yeah it's really good it's very complex flavor actually goes down here this this and then Kind of comes back. It's weirdly like refreshing. Way. Like I think I could like drink it, but right. then I don't want to just because it's it the complexity and like is much yeah. more of a sipper and just yeah. Man, this is really good. Yeah, no, that's can good. you get any more of this? Yes, I have. I have a lot of this. Excellent. I have uh, or uh, Trader Joe's. At least no, Trader you personally. The, at your no, house. not personally. I have no, a whole last <laughs> last year. I actually bought a case of it just right when it came in. Oh, um, wow. I had did not do that this year. Um, Are you regretting that? But no, well, I could. I've got like ten cases in the back oh, okay. and like five out on the floor. So there's plenty of this available. So what was when the this, price point of this? I'm sorry, we it's eight ninety nine. Well, that's that's a good price. Wow. Yeah, so eight ninety nine. So yeah. So when this uh, hashtag not an ad. Now those of <laughs> those who are watching live get a little preview. They can run right out tomorrow if they're within obviously this you know the <laughs> yeah. the local area here. Uh, they can go and and grab this Pretty tomorrow. Much everyone had this available, right? I don't know. I would. Th- I think it was made available to all Trader Joe's. I believe. Okay. Yes. So, uh, but you can go out Your and get it now. May vary. If not, this podcast when it's when it comes out, when you see this, it should still be available. Uh, so, but like, but knowing, 
the quality behind it, like I said, with with Petrus, that name. Like we've had yeah. other beers from them that are their yeah. own. Odd they're not going to put their name on something that's even if it's a, a lesser version of a style. Or they're still going to do quality. So oh, that's yeah. why you like you didn't have a problem trying that or going you know right. like we had with some of the other ones. Right. But this is definitely of the. Is this probably the third one we've kind of had? Well, we had this version last year, the pale, and then we had... Okay, it was not uh, like this last year. And we had the grape, a grapefruit, I think I brought over when we were I super I swear I've had the... Didn't we have the raspberry one over your house? Or not the raspberry, maybe the cherry. I, okay, cherry. Maybe I remember cherry. a pink label. Yeah. I know we well, had that one. the pink label was here. Oh, the pink label? That's that was the, the grapefruit? grapefruit I brought over. Yeah, oh. the cherry was black with red writing on it. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, the, the grapefruit was the, the pink. And I think I brought that over here. We did that like either warming up or while we were super seducing or something like that. Oh, okay. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, this is this is uh this is quite good. It's quite good. We will we will continue to enjoy this. Yes. And uh hopefully you will continue to enjoy uh other things at aboutbeverages.com, which is the website uh where we do all these different tastings, uh reviews. We don't like officially quite review anything anymore. I kinda like that we just do the tasting thing. Uh, you know, and it's it's more about you to decide. And we'll, I mean, obviously, if you watch us, you'll know if we liked it or not. Right. So it's you know. You mean like our you, tasting notes? No, not the or? tasting notes per se. But we used to be like, oh, we give this a one, right? Yeah. It was, like it was yeah. kind of like always. You know, it's like you should. I know that's like a quick shorthand that some people would like. Like, yeah. oh, they gave it a two or they gave it a whatever. But it's kind of nice. Like you really should want to get the whole article, the whole thing. Like even if you skim through this quickly. I mean, these aren't that long. They're right. like little little bites. But anyway. Uh, you can head on over to the website and find uh, other things that we've tried, or you can uh, subscribe to us on YouTube, uh, which is a uh, brand new startup. I don't know if you've heard of it yet. Uh, they, uh, we think there's a, they've got a bright future. I think they have a chance. Uh, they have a lot of our videos up there, uh, not going quite back as far as the website, but quite a few. Um, and uh, yeah, uh, the, uh, I, think that's, I think that's all. Is well, there anything else? Would you else? give this on our rating scale? I'd give this a pretty solid two. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say. Yeah. I, so I, I almost yeah. borderline would say a three just because it's so good. Like yeah. it's really complex. Yeah. You know, I've had other things that I've liked as much, but this is this is yeah, it's a solid two and maybe a three. Three was the highest on our scale. Right. We, we went put zero that out to now. It's not right. out of ten. We went zero to three. Yeah, because we, we could say zero is literally like it was like a dumpster fire. Right. And then one was like, eh, maybe in certain situations yeah. it was okay. It's was, not my favorite, but it's not. There's nothing bad. wrong with it. There's but nothing it's not wrong right. with it. Zero basically meant there was something wrong with it. Yeah. And, and dear God, why yeah. would anyone put this in their mouth? Right. Um, whether it's a beer or whatever, it could be a wine, anything. <laughs> uh, and then, yeah, obviously, two was we really liked it. You should go get it. And three was like, don't even finish listening to this recording. Please right. go out the door. And yeah, we may it. have already yeah. left. Because we didn't have it. Yeah, we, we've actually already left. You've just seen like a swirl of. There's just two number threes sitting here. Yeah, and, exactly. And we're out. Uh, but uh, yeah. Oh, the other thing I forgot to mention. If you want to watch us live and be able to participate, comment, do all those kinds of things, have beverages along with us. Uh, in that format, twitch.tv slash about beverages is the place where you can uh, find us most Thursday nights. Yes. Uh, around 630 Pacific Standard Time. That may change when the whole time change thing happens, yeah. but we'll go with that for right now. Yes. But as we always say, whether we like it or not, you should give it a shot. <laughs>